Hello and thanks for joining School of the American Rifle. Today I want to discuss a potential issue that I want you to at least be able to identify. Doesn't mean that this particular brand of selector is bad, but just something that can happen. So this is a radiant selector. And if we push on this thing hard, I'm pushing it with my thumb this way, we can, in some cases, spin out of the timing spot and it will not run. So now we're back to safe, fire, but if you spin it, push it just the right way, I can jump right out of track with it and she ain't gonna go off. See, we're locked up hard. So it's just something you wanna be aware of. If you know how to do this, you can normally get it back in the position like I just did by pushing hard, but basically any kind of tension here can cause it to jump out of its track. So just something to be aware of. It doesn't mean it's a bad selector, bad safety. Just be aware that some lowers with some fire control groups, some pistol grips, some detents with some selectors can do this. Hope you found this video educational. Thanks for watching.